Hi everybody and welcome back to Leg Up Ability, your premier power equestrian sport channel. In today's video we are going to look at the FEI power classification process, what it is and how you get processed. So, in order to compete in a power competition, either nationally or internationally, you need to be classified as a power equestrian. Hello, Lou. So, what is the FEI power classification system? Well, basically, it's a system designed to enable people with disabilities to compete against each other on an equal basis by mitigating the impact of the disability on the performance. So how does the system work? Well, the system works by organising power questions who have similar sporting abilities into different grades. And with power grasses having five grades and power carriage driving having two grades, whereby the lower the grade, the higher the impact of a person's disability on their sporting abilities. Whereas the higher the grade, the least impact a person's disability has on their sporting performance. So, that's how the system works. So, we know what it is, we know how it works. Now, how do you get classified? In Ireland, like many other countries, it's actually pretty straightforward. What you do, it, you go to the Paralympic.ie website to check if you have an eligible disability and then you download the medical diagnostic form, fill it in put, by providing the relevant medical documents. You then send it off to the classification department at classification at paralympic.ie. Then you will be assessed on three merits. First of all, you will be given a physical assessment to see how the disability impacts you, either by your movement or your strength or your coordination, among other factors. And then you go into the technical phase, and this is where the assessor will evaluate how your disability impacts your sporting performance. And they will look at it in a competitive scenario and a non-competitive scenario. So for example, with me, they may assess how my ha shaky hands will impact my, the holding of my reins. After that stage, you go into the third stage, which is the competitive analysis. And basically what they do there, is they evaluate how your disability impact your performance in a competitive setting. So, I really hope you got something from the video and you never know, one day I might go and get graded myself, but as I don't compete, I'm not required to get a grading. But it would be interesting to see what grade I'd be. Um, I really hope you got something for this video and I'll catch you in the next video. Okay, bye!